Okay, so, um, not really sure how to start a video like this, um, never really made a video like this, but, uh, um, I, you know, I mean, I'm sure you've seen from the, uh, the title, you know, wh what the video is going to be about, but, uh, and I know this might come as a, a shock um, or a surprise to a lot of you, considering I've been making uh, pipe videos for the better part of three years now. Um, you know, I, in this the year I've had this year, you know, I, I launched the Pipe Nook uh, web store. Um, you know, I'm sure a lot of you are thinking is, you know, is this real? Is he putting us on or whatever? It's very new. Um, I, I, you know, I made this decision this morning, uh, but you know, I can't assure you that it's, you know, definitely. It really happened, and uh, it's, you know, not something that I can, you know, walk away from. So let me let me back up and just tell you what happened this morning. I was. Um, actually smoking a pipe this morning and was sitting here thinking you know I need to get to work uh, because I was a little short this week uh, I was probably at 36 hours I needed to go put in some hours today and I thought you know if I finish this pipe um, odds are I'm probably not gonna get into work and so I uh, had a decision to make and I I made it and I sat my pipe down and I went to work well you know fast forward uh, I worked my three and a half or so hours and uh, I came home so So that's why I quit smoking a pipe. And I can tell you, it's not the first time I've made that decision, and it's always a tough one. <laughs> so, today I am smoking a pipe. So, today I am smoking a pipe from a pipe maker that shall not as yet be named. I will be carrying this pipe maker very shortly, probably next week. I'm smoking some McBaron's Navy Flake and what I'm trying to decide is What's a good flake to order a ton of and sell her? Um, I've always thought Stokeby's Luxury Navy Flake would be a good one. Um, but lately when I smoke it, uh, there's just not enough... There's not enough Perique in it. Um, it's, here's the flavor profile for me. It's a very light Perique, Virginia Perique. It's mostly Virginia, little tiny bit of Perique, kind of like Orlick. Maybe a little bit more Perique than Orlick, but not by much. But when I start smoking it, there's almost nothing there. It's like um, drinking a really, really lightly brewed tea. Not much tea there. Um, But what I like about Stokeby's Luxury Navy Flake is the further down the bowl you go, um, it turns into a nice medium bodied smoke. So for me, it's one of those blends, one of those rare blends that um, ends better than it begins. Usually it's the inverse of that for me. Um, 
you know, for a lot of, like, let's say for the Cornell and Deal uh, Burley Flakes. They start off really good, and I think, man, I'm in Burley Heaven here. And by halfway through the bowl, <laughs> I'm having nicotine fits. And it just turns really harsh for me. And I've talked about that before. So they, you know, those type blends start off, you know, as a nice robust blend and just get, they go downhill from there for me to the point where I dump them out because they're not enjoyable anymore. Well, for the Luxury Navy Flake, I start off with it and it's almost like I'm not smoking anything but hot air. And then the further down the bowl it goes, it gets better and better. To where it's, it's a medium bodied smoke for me. Here's what I'd like, and if you guys have any kind of um, suggestions for me as to this, um, I, I would more than welcome any suggestions, because again, I'm trying to put together an order for September, um, because Pipes and Cigars is doing Stokeby blends at 20% off all month. And I haven't made any large cellaring uh, purchases like a lot of y'all have. At least not in recent months since the whole FDA scare. But what I'd like is something that starts off a little bit more on the medium bodied side uh, than the Stokeby and goes to, like, maybe starts light medium and goes to heavy medium and that's what it does a flake that does that would be preferable if it were Virginia Perique flake so if you guys have any suggestions as to a replacement for the Stokeby I'm all ears um, this is a good one the McBaron's Navy flake And, uh, but the problem is, you know, it doesn't have any Perique in it. It's a Virginia Bur Burley Cavendish. Same thing with University Flake from Peterson's. I really like it. It's a good medium bodied, uh, flake that doesn't get harsh to me. But, um, it doesn't have Perique either. I think it's just Burley and Virginia. And I love my Periques. So, all right, y'all. I know that was the worst form of Derek Tant slash smoking pipeliner clickbait. But I had to do it. It was uh, something I drummed up in my old brain on the drive home thinking about this pipe. Hmm. <laughs> So anyway, we'll leave it at that, and we'll chat with y'all later.